His motto, drive at the limit. His achievements, a world driver's title. And his goal, following 2007, to win this for Ferrari once again. Kimi Raikkonen, 29 years young and usually rather taciturn. Kimi, you speak, please, please. Yeah, one, two. That's the way Finns are. But in his free time at home in Switzerland, he can be the wild, high-spirited guy that he often keeps concealed at the track. The switch to Ferrari in 2007, however, did make him appear more relaxed. And after his first year, he was already praising his employers. For him, in almost gushing terms. Oh, I feel more home, for sure. Uh, being second year now, you know, with the same team. Uh, we had a very, very good season in the end. Last year, we won the both championships. and. Uh, in the beginning, it was a bit difficult times, but uh, the team has always been very, very nice and very helpful. And now, when I know the team better, I think so it's going to be easier to go for the new season and uh, prepare everything. So, I, I think so it can be a good year. Despite all expectations, grey clouds appeared in 2008. Mission title defence failed, and his greatest rival up to the last race was none other than teammate Felipe Massa. He thinks highly of the cool Finn, even though he can account directly for the differences between their two characters, hitting the nail right on the head. We are uh, different uh, personalities, you know, I'm Brazilian, I'm very Latin, uh, uh, hot blood, <laughs> and he's uh, coming from, from Finland, for sure, he's not uh, uh, talking so much, he's a bit uh, close, but uh, in a way we, we both has, have the same uh, target the same goals and we, we work very well together. Here they accept Raikkonen just the way he is, which is probably the reason for this statement. And I have still two years to go with, uh, with my recent contract and then um, I always said that uh, for sure the team where I'm now in, uh, in Ferrari is going to be my last team. That doesn't mean he wants to stop racing completely in 2010. After all, with his friendly manner, he'd be sorely missed. Rallying is his great dream. Even now, he takes part occasionally in selected races and would certainly like to prove himself in this sport. You could say that he's an odd man out in the F1 circus. You could also say, however, that this characteristic is particularly endearing. It certainly is to his fans. Give Give Who will cheer him on again in 2009 on his way to trying to clinch the F1 crown.